<laughs> okay, seriously, this is meant for a much younger person than me, but we're gonna talk about it today. I don't know why they call these hoverboards, because you're not really hovering, but I guess it's, yeah, it's trying to go. That's kind of the idea of what it's supposed to, stop moving, it's chasing me. Stop, stop. Hi everybody, welcome to Photo Joseph's Photo Moment, and you're wondering, this is a photography show, why are you playing with a child's toy? I'm not, stop it. It's trying to eat me. Okay, I'm no Casey Neistat, there's no way I can ride this thing like any athlete can, but it's kind of fun, so I don't really, I, I got this thing on Amazon, it's kind of cool. Companies reach out to me a lot and say, hey, you do a lot of reviews, you do videos, would you like to do a video review about this product? Cool, right? And I turn a lot of it down because a lot of it's just stuff that I'm not interested in. And I figure, you know, I want to do stuff that you, my audience, will actually like. And this one came in and I'm like, it's a hoverboard. What is, how, why, how does that have anything to do with, wait a second, this is like the world's best gimbal. You can handhold this thing and roll all over the place and it becomes a really cool gimbal. So now we've got a hover gimbal. At least that's what I'm selling it as. Now, the reason that we're talking about this today, um, and I was supposed to apparently do a video a couple days ago, but I kind of messed that up. But today, you know how there's the whole Amazon Prime days? Today, and maybe tomorrow, but at least today, the 16th of July, is that right? Yes. This is a 20% off sale. So let me just show you that first to get this out of the way so I don't forget. So the product is from a company called Gyroor, G-Y-R-O-O-R, Gyroor Warrior 8.5 inch Ultra. So this is the all-terrain off-road hoverboard, which is kind of crazy cool. It actually goes on dirt, and you're going to see that in a moment. No, I'm not bringing dirt into the studio. Um, the normal price is $2.99, but you can see here they've got an, even an ad on here, 20% off for Prime Day deals. It says on here July 16th to 17th. I thought it was just today, so your mileage may vary, but it's going to be 20% off of this. So if you're thinking about one of these, even if, you know, if you're not like... You're not, thinking, oh, this is a great gimbal. It is kind of a cool gimbal kind of a thing, but if that's not what you're thinking, you just want to get one for your kid, then then great time to do it, right? Okay, so they reach out to me, they say, hey, will you do a review on this thing, or like a little video around it, and, and, and for Prime Day deal thing, and I'm thinking, great, gimbal, this is awesome, there's my connection. I try to ride this thing, as you just saw, I mean, I just about killed myself the first time. So I'm wearing boots today. There's a reason I'm wearing boots. Ryan, why don't you come out here? Um, Ryan's going to show you He's going to man the other camera and show you how badly I ride this thing. But I'm sure many of you are far more capable than I am and would actually manage to do this well. I'm wearing the boots because if you wear small, regular shoes, it will eat your ankles. It's like a total, you know, those little ankle biter dogs. It's like an ankle biter dog, but with metal teeth. So wear boots. Just trust me on this one if you are, if you are, um, <laughs> of a certain age, shall we say. Okay, all right, so let me give you a quick tour of this thing. Because it is actually pretty darn cool. Um, it pivots like this, that's how you turn. So you're standing on here and you pivot your feet and that's how you do the turning. If you wanna go forward, you lean forward. You wanna go back, you lean back. And you can see it's already, it's moving like that. Um, it's not moving when I do this because I'm not standing on it. But anyway, so that's that. There's not too many buttons on this thing. There's a power button right there, power on and off. That's all there is to that. The thing has a Bluetooth connection, there's an app now, the manual doesn't tell you any of this. There's a little disconnect between the box and the manual, <laughs> but there's an app. If you just search Gyroor on the App Store, there's an app. You connect to it over Bluetooth, and you can then control the maximum speed of it, which is really good when you're learning. And it'll tell you the current speed. Uh, there's a child mode that you can put it in. I'm not really sure what that does. Um, might just slow it down, not really sure. But anyway, so there's a child mode. And a couple other things that you can do in there. Oh, you can change the colors of the lights. So it's got these LEDs on it. You can change the colors of them. Why not, right? So that's that. Anyway, so this, okay. Take this for with a grain of salt. Um, you can hear it. I'm going to do that again. You, you hear it beep when I step on it. Okay, that means it's kind of ready. And then I'm going to, I've managed to do this without having something to hold on to, which is pretty fantastic, honestly. And then I'm going to shake like a scared little chihuahua. But there we go. I'm working. I'm working at it. See, look at that. And then you go forward. <laughs> You go backward, and this thing goes crazy fast. You're going to see in a moment because I got some video of my 14 year old son who is far more capable of driving this thing than I am. Um, really moving it, really making this thing sing. And he's like, I don't understand, Dad. It's so easy. I'm like, Shut up, kid. So, anyway, so if you would imagine now, let me go get my camera. See, I'm, I'm kind of getting there. I'm kind of getting there. Um, let's go get the camera. Whoa. Okay, let's get there. We go. I'm going to turn around. How cool is that? Turning around, it still looks a little bit dark, Ryan. Are you getting a bright enough image on this thing? There we go. 
Okay, so you can imagine now, you know, once you get capable, which I clearly am not yet, but what a great gimbal, right? You got this thing, in, instead of having to carry it and walk, you've got this smooth camera movement. I mean, that's pretty awesome, right? I'm gonna put that down before I drop it. Um, so I think, I think this is really cool and could be very, very good once you get good at it, obviously. Now, so this one being off-road, obviously once you hit dirt, it's gonna be a bit bumpy. So if you wanna do the smooth gimbal thing, I think you're gonna need a smooth road. But, um, but that's it. Now, here, I'm gonna show you why you need the boots, at least if you're me. I'm gonna get off this thing and it's gonna attack me because I don't know how my son just steps off of it and it doesn't move, but whenever I get off of it, it's like, it, <laughs> see, it does that. It wants to eat me. Okay, just stop. It has speak, apparently you can play music through it, although I can never quite figure that one out. It says so on the box, I couldn't get it. Anyway, let's go back over here. So that's, that's, <laughs> that's the gimbal. <laughs> it's a hover gimbal. All right, so that's a hover gimbal. Let me show you what it looks like when someone who actually knows what they're doing rides this thing, because that's far more impressive. <laughs> can do it. See, if he can do it, then you can do it. If you're 14. Uh, he makes it look easy, obviously. And it took him about three seconds to figure this thing out. I'm still clumsy, clumsily moving along, but I think it's pretty awesome. I genuinely think if you're, if you're good at it, clearly you got to get good at it. You got to be very confident at it, but it'd be a great camera tool, right? It's a great way to get those nice, smooth rolling shots um, instead of having a gimbal, it actually costs quite a bit less than a gimbal, so that's something to consider. I mean, a good gimbal starts at, what, $500 at least, and they go up from there. So if this fits into your shooting style, your lifestyle, if you're young enough to be able to handle writing this thing, then I think it is a pretty awesome way to, to shoot. I mean, why not? It's just another tool in the arsenal. Plus, your kids will love it because you finally have a, a hoverboard that they've been asking for. Um, but there you go. That's it. That's the hoverboard. So if you're interested in this sort of thing, remember, the, today, the 16th, is when it's on the big sale. Um, obviously, you can buy it anytime, but if you want to save 20%, do it now. Link down below. Uh, click on that thing, and off you go, and you're going to get it on these uh, Prime Days. You might even see it pop up in your phone on the Prime Days, but, you know, click my link. That's always nice. That's the affiliate link down there. I do appreciate that. And uh, and that's that. So we're going to we're gonna do a little Q&A here. Oh, you want to see the box? It's a big box. There you go. It's a box. See, the box shows there's an app, but there's nothing on the in the manual about the... Anyway... Off-road, water, weatherproof. We took it on the dirt and the grass. You saw it on the grass, uphill, downhill. I didn't take it through the mud, but um, yeah, pretty cool. All right, guys, that's it. Let's do a Q&A. See if you have any questions about this or anything else you want to talk about, and we'll be right back for that.